Alright, hello, and welcome back to finally a brand new episode of The Legend of Zelda The Minish Cap. Now, when I last left off, um, that was a recording that I did back in 2019, so it's still been a very, very long time since I last played. And what I remember is that uh, the Fortress of Winds, in particular, has become really, really, uh, really hard to figure out. Um, even with walkthroughs, I even followed a walkthrough, believe it or not, and I still cannot figure it out. So, let's hoping that this time um, I do a better job of that. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to get that map that's up there. This is actually my second attempt at recording this because, well, I got completely lost and I just I wasted a bunch of time. Still can't figure this freaking place out. It's a real big fat vein in my my existence. Um, I hate it. I hate everything about it because it's annoying, but I still love this game. So don't get me wrong, I'm not uh, trying to uh, say that I don't like this game. I just don't like this dungeon. It's really, really, really... Oh, that's nice. Really, really annoying. Hey, got some arrows. Nice. Just what I needed, actually. Alright, mister. You're going down, buddy. Hey, thank you. Needed those arrows. Alright, so give me this map. So, uh, in my previous take, I have said I felt like I've already been through this part already. And as it turns out, I'm pretty sure I have. Um, it's just that I've done so many numerous takes on the recording. Because of so much of me not getting anywhere. Okay, let's go through this door this time. See what we find. Okay. Sounds promise- um, feels promising so far. Not too sure about it, but... Okay. Oh, hi there. Oh, God. <laughs> Hear that hand! Oh, my lord, have mercy. You wouldn't be so kind as to take me across, would you? Okay, so I'm guessing that I need, uh, like, some kind of hooky shoddy something there, because that's what it's feeling as though I may need. Usually these guys give you a lot of money, so that's why I'm kind of trying to kill it. Well, in Ocarina of Time, they gave a lot more money than that. Oh, hello, everybody. Uh... You might be wondering why I'm suddenly uh, standing here holding a kinstone piece. Well, this is actually now my sixth uh, recording attempt. I decided to just cut right here. <laughs> um, now, as it turns out, like I originally thought, like that would need like a hook shot or something to hook shot to, like in Link's Awakening. But as it turns out, you just gotta shoot them. So, yep, I said it. This is literally my. Um, sixth recording attempt. <laughs> anyway, welcome back. Uh, for you guys, it's only been like, uh, like a split second. But for me, it's been, what, an hour and 20 minutes? Literally, it took me that long to figure that out. <laughs> anyway, so this is this mini-boss. I figured out, um, this mini-boss pretty, um, quite fast, actually. You need to use bombs. I don't know if there's any other way to fight him, other than using bombs. If there is, uh, you guys can let me know in the comments. But for now, this is the only way I know, for sure. It takes about three or four hits, I think. To defeat this Dark Nut. Ah, hit the bomb! One more hit ought to do it. I, I believe so, yeah. Oh, okay, there we go. And there's a warp thing that spawns there. That's nice. You're not gonna give me anything. 
<laughs> All right, then. Well, thank you for that one rupee. Ah! Fresh L. Ah! Yeah, why not? Let's just go to the death way. <laughs> I guess so. Ah, thank you. I needed that. Ah, nice and healthy. It's actually been quite a while since I played any Zelda game, actually. Sort of looking forward to it. Also, I was confused about this, but as it turns out, you need to put a bomb here. So you can get something that is very useful. Which was confusing me like crazy. It's this glove thing that allows you to dig. You got the mole mitts. Dig, dig, dig. Now, I originally thought you would get like the hook shot or something or something like that in this dungeon, but nope. You get that. So, that's good. I will put you there. I really wish that there was like three buttons that you could uh, map things to. Ah, uh, all my problems have washed away <laughs> now that I have the, the digging mitts. I got a hundred rupees. I am so glad that I found where that is. I am so relieved. It's finally looking up in the world. The world of Zelda. Alright, let's go this way. I need the... His face is redder than a stump. Redder than a beet. Ooh, phew, we barely made it. I was certain we'd run out of time. Alright, I'm so glad that I finally know what to do here. Now, we were encountered the red one, which is actually called a wall master. These are floor masters, but they basically do the same thing that the red ones do, the wall masters. They take you back to the entrance of the dungeon. So I say, stay back, creepy hands. Now, we will be getting to this in a minute. In a hot minute. For now, we need to get a key by activating this, these switches over there. Which took me forever to figure out. Learn from my mistakes. Don't let those things hit you. <laughs> Just hide in the hole. My hidey hole. Alright, I need to position these in the corners. Put you there. You know, now that I figured it out, I come to realize that it's actually not that hard, really. It just really confuses me for some reason, I guess. Start you down here. Oh, well that was wrong. Ah, oh. very pharmaceuticals. go. Give me that key. Thank you. Alright, I need to go back and become Minish Size. Woohoo! Can't get me.
become a little bitty itty minish. This game is so fascinating to me. <laughs> In particular, this game, Zelda game. In the way that, uh... It's just so adorable. I believe so. Ow! I did that all wrong. You need to be patient. Oh, crap. I will be right back. Woohoo! That almost got me there. Interesting. Got some more floor masters over there. those glowing things were. Um, I'm gonna... I think I'll be fine. Alright, it is time to... I wonder if I could fall down here. Probably wouldn't be good. Oh my, I can. Well, at least those things don't seem to notice me when I'm tiny. Yeah, <laughs> say stay back. Alright, please give me a heart. Okay, then don't. Fine. Be that way. Maybe I can get one up here. Maybe. Or maybe not. Okay, I just have to deal with that noise. That was lost on me. So I can whack them with my sword. Good to know. <laughs> Wonder where this leads. Oh crap! <laughs> oh man, holy fresh hell. <laughs> Hi there. Oh, you. I don't like you. This might be an opportune moment. For you to give me a heart, I would really greatly appreciate that. Okay, I think it's time for one of the good old. Well, first of all, um, let's save here. I'm just going to use real saves. I'm not going to use save states. So if I die, at least I saved here. So that's important. Oh, you just... Uh... Please give me a heart. Please give me a heart. I beg of you, please just give me a heart. Oh, you are so not nice. What in fresh hell is this? Interesting. Am I meant to fall down these things? I don't know, let's find out. 
Huh. Oh, how nice. Oh, how lovely. I just happened to fall down the wrong one, of course. Leave it to me to fumble everything in my life. Oh, fresh hell, you are back. I figure it prudent to just avoid them. Okay, give me. Yes, boss key. Got the boss key, all right. Now the question I am, that is on my mind. So, oh, okay, well that's convenient. Let's open up the map here. Actually, I might be calling this an episode here. Um, so, I made some good bit of progress. Uh, the next episode, I reckon I'll be fighting the boss. But, uh, that's gonna be it for this episode. It was a bit of a rocky start, although you didn't see all the truly rocky and horror of my frustration. But, I think I did. Whoa, what is that? What in fresh hell is that? That kind of scared me. Okay. I think that's just the lighting. Wait, what is that? That legitimately scared me. Oh my lord, have mercy. Wait. Continuing all the way around. Oh my god! There's a fly on my camera. There's a fly on my camera. Oh my god, that scared the living hell out of me. Holy fresh hell. Oh my gosh. Well, whatever that fly did, it seemed to have, uh, did something to my camera here. <laughs> anyway, uh, before I end this episode, let me try to fix this. Uh, hang on. Maybe if I use a wipe. It must have puked on it. <laughs> I don't know. Something went wrong there. Okay. I don't know what happened there. Okay, that seemed to have sort of fixed it. Anyway, I'm still a little bright, but... Anyway, that's going to be it for this episode. That fly <laughs> messed up my camera for some reason. Anyway, I will. Um, that's it for this episode. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. And also, uh, if you go to... Uh, I will leave a link in the description for my live stream and upload schedule. And so you can check that out and see what's coming. Um, my November month schedule and everything else. Anyway, that's better. Okay. Um, so, go check that out, and remember to uh, subscribe, and click on that bell to turn on notifications so you can stay up to date on all my latest live streams and episodes, so you don't miss anything. Uh, be sure to do that. Um, it's real easy. Just click that subscribe button, and click on that bell to turn on notifications. It's that simple. Then you can, then you won't miss anything. You won't miss any um, new uploads, new uh, live streams. So be sure to do that. And again, thank you so much for watching. And if it wasn't for you guys, I, if it wasn't for you guys supporting me, um, this would not be possible. So again, I would like to thank you guys so much for watching, and I hope you enjoyed. Um, this dungeon is really frustrating. But I will see you in the next one, next video. Bye now!